today we're going grocery shopping at Ikea? to make a lunch out of our spoils and they didn't have any cheese or meat so we picked that up at our local grocery store and now have created a nice little charcuterie board start off with the dry crisp bread oh no we got a crack cracker but look at that really interesting texture to it This actually isn't as flavorless as I thought. We will each get half a cracker. I think I want to try the creamed smoked fish rope. So it sort of looks like it's in a toothpaste like tube. Oh yeah. So if you know what imitation crab meat tastes like, Oh, it's actually quite salty. I'm gonna pair this with the creamed fish roe. That's actually a pretty good combination. The cheese is nice and creamy. Um, and then the crackers adding a lot of texture. And then the fish roe is just adding that bit of fishiness that is actually quite pleasant. Up next, we have the mustard and dill sauce. I think I'm going to pair this with the smoked sandwich. It said it was sustainably sourced, so that's always a good thing. So Eric's going to lay down a bit of the mustard and dill. I'm going to put this hunk and piece of salmon on top. And that actually looks pretty darn good. Mm. The next thing we have is marinated herring with the dill. We got another herring marinated with onion. Try the herring with onion. It's actively dripping. I'm sure that's not even appetizing to look at. Ready? That's good. Oh, I like that. The brine that it's marinating in is giving it so much flavor. You've got a bit of acidity, you've got the onion taste. The texture of the herring is soft. I don't think anybody would be weirded out by the by the texture of it. Shall we try the other ones? So I'll go for the dill. I like the dill up there. Mm. Mm. Dill high. Last IKEA item on the menu is the red seaweed pearls. Mm. Oh, that's a really interesting flavor. In sushi restaurants, add a lot of uh, the roe to their sushis. But this tastes different. It doesn't have a fishy flavor. This is this is good. This just tastes like it's so hard to describe, but I would say that it just tastes fresh. We're gonna finish up our lunch and we'll come back with some final thoughts. For dessert, we're gonna give these ginger thins a try. Plain and very thin cookie. And I think it's gonna have a very crispy texture. Mmm, this is really good. What was your favorite item that you ate? I think the, the dill hair is my favorite. For me, I really enjoyed the smoked salmon. I thought that was actually really tasty and for Ikea, largely surprising. What was your least favorite item that you ate? The salami because it's the most spicy. Oh yeah. This is my least favorite. Mm -hmm. it, it wasn't offensive. It's a taste to you. It's definitely different. It'll probably grow on. That is our Ikea charcuterie board grocery haul. I hope you enjoyed everything that we showed you today. It has been largely eye-opening. I can't wait to try more of their stuff. See you later.